This shot was done for the Mexican Soccer League or the FMF. Frequently in advertising photography, you're handed a drawing that's called a comp, and my job is to take that comp, that drawing, and turn it into a photograph and bring it to life. The idea is to have the mouth and the teeth of the person become the mouth and teeth of the animal. Really a great concept and looked very cool when everyone was painted. We shot them in groups of two, four, and then six. If I'm doing a shot that has a backdrop, whether it's a painted backdrop or whether it's a photo reel backdrop, uh, really the backdrop becomes the first thing you've got to set up and becomes a parameter for the entire photograph. The first set of lights I'm putting up are four umbrellas, two on each side of the backdrop. We then flagged it with a full piece of foam core on end to cut the light off the camera. The second set of lights we're going to add is a row of three bare heads with diffusion, shining just onto the lower field portion of the backdrop. I then flagged these lights to keep them from flaring into the camera. We placed three Hensel heads with grid spots on each side to light each one of our talent. Each talent had a dedicated light with a grid spot on it. It was done in a butterfly so that you get a nice drawing on the face. You see shadows into the side of the face towards the camera. We now added a large soft box from behind the talent. This acted as like a soft rim on each of the talent. You can see its effect on the tops of their heads. Kind of gave us a nice rim across each of their heads from behind. But I wanted just a little harder light on the backs of their heads as a rim light. So we added one grid spot on each side that we rimmed the backs of their heads with. This gave us a little harder light on the backs of their heads and looked very nice. We now added a bounce fill, we pushed a piece of foam core in from the front on the camera left side. This picks up the top back soft box and bounces some of that light back into the shadow side of the faces creating just a soft fill in the foreground. We now added an umbrella behind the camera as a fill light. This umbrella we could dial up and down and just open up the shadows and just a soft fill that we don't see any direction with but opens up the shadows so we can see into them a little bit. At this point, it really becomes a tweaking process. You dial this pack up a little bit, you dial that one down, you kind of move the lights a little bit to the right or the left. That's really what I love about photography is this process. It's the process of lighting things and creating an image, seeing the vision, not just from props and background and talent and painting, but also light. It all comes together to create the final image. Subscribe to the Slanted Lens channel on YouTube.